It don't go for this. This is. Nah. Over the old this. Over the old this. Over the old this. Over the old this. Ah, before you go, before they go drop the money, you don't already they run out of cash. Okay, okay, okay. Now it's like you don't cast. You don't cast. You don't cast. You don't cast. Eh, you don't cast. Even the thirty-three thousand, no, they do again. Why? Ah, that thing now, nah, I just did like 3,300. Hey! <laughs> in a, a mad, oh! What's it fair? Okay, my bro, how are you now? I know. I just smile, enjoy the suit. You guys are saying, I three cases, they rent. No, 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 no. You make us smile, no video. Hey, how is your name? My name is nah, Emmanuel. Emmanuel? Hey, yeah. Emmanuel Chukwese. Eze. Emmanuel yeah. Eze. Ah, I know, ah, ah, I don't know Chukwese. I don't know. You come from West State? Hey, boy, State. Hey, boy, State. Yeah. Where, where is the state capital of Hey, boy? About Liki. Are you sure? Yeah. For real? Yeah. Ah, ah. Now, 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 Abbreviation about clicky. Okay, I'm not clicking. 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 i am not clicking i before they go drop the money, you don't already they run out of cash. Yeah. <laughs> you know, so that they, they, can, they do for you. You know they do, you know they do. I thought, okay, they Lina, how many, okay. how many okay. Oh. did they spend your time? Oh. I know be, it, it's unpredictable, but depending. Okay. You know, transport is there, transportation fare and everything, you understand? Yeah. So, now why that I you just uh, transportation, tell me if you calculate your transportation per month, sir, it's up to 25,000, sir. Eh, eh, nah. Transportation alone, not transportation alone. alone. It's just that sometimes you can get from different sources to just make up for it. Okay, if you can play the transportation alone, it's more than it. Well, some people they tell me say that the Nakopas the bad who pass for Nigeria like no, this. No, Nakopas no they do anything. Nakopas they will pass them. Eh, eh, nah, so uh, as you become like this now, eh. this Nigeria economy is really affecting. Ah, Nakopas you affect pass eh, because if they allow you. Let's put the NYSC aside. Okay. If they allow you to do your business, you'll be able to get more money than, than okay. even this because you are, you are being kept at one corner. Mm. Like you are just doing this thing, let the program finish, right? You just find your way. Okay, like this, like this now. You prefer to say, you go serve, maybe they do business rather than serving you. Uh, I wouldn't say uh, on its own. I know that NYC has also has impact. Okay. You understand? Uh, it has impact on even the one that's doing it and the people that you are impacting knowledge to. So, but the other aspect of it, I would just uh, say that if the government can just increase the allowance and all this kind of thing, it will help the person that is even doing the work not to be frustrated and that kind of thing, you understand? So, the allowance should be touched. Uh, and the standard, it has some kind of a key standard on it. Uh, they should just amend, make amendments to it and something like that. So, yeah, because... Yeah. So, if you are the president now, how much will you put a compass allowance? Ah, if I'm the president, if I'm to put the cover allowance, I'll calculate transport purpose and calculate it based on the uh, the current economy, the price of things, before you know how much you are going to be paying them. It's not something that is stable because the economy is subject to fluctuation. So it's as you see how the economy goes, you know the price of things. How does a uh, how does a Nigerian every Nigerian how much does every Nigerian eat? You know, it's a it's an economy that is deteriorating day by day because uh, if you check very well, the price of cooked food is even cheaper than the price of uncooked food now. Uh, I'm telling you the truth. Food one you, is cheaper than, than the more price than of uncooked. But it's, it's not supposed to be so. Mm. It's not supposed to be so. Uncooked food should be cheaper than cooked food. So you now on the outside you buy food shop, you know buy food shop. Some, sometimes I cook, sometimes like now I want to buy something I want to cook. Sometimes I cook, sometimes I don't cook. If I check the expense and everything, the stress, the gas, everything, we just prepare to buy. To buy yeah, like, like now, yes, if like now you can buy beans like this, like 200 naira, you just maybe use gare to oh take God. it. Uh -huh. well, if you want to cook, if you want to cook uh, look at now, one What's cup that? of beans, one cup of beans, new cup like this, one cup of beans now, how much is it? 300 so 300 or, two, or 250 or so so but if you now go to buy beans you will spend 200 naira so uh, yeah with gary you have drank it and you go your way and you'll be satisfied okay if i now use buy one cup of beans okay let me just say i want to buy what have the rika now 
have the rika is it's supposed to be around 500 or 600 in some places uh -huh. so if i buy half the rika what about the maggi what about the oil what about uh, the, the the gas pepper, use, the pepper, pepper. Uh -huh. everything. everything to use and cook it. But if I use that six hundred naira, I will buy beans. I cannot even eat. Oh, you calculate this thing well, well. Uh -huh. Now, now I cannot air cons. I studied engineering. Engineering. Ah, why would try you? Oh my God! Yes, she has to split them one by one. Honestly, the ah. thing is alarming. It's alarming. It's not yeah. something that should be. Sorry, I believe. Uh, if you ask me to say yeah. this Nigeria can really go forward, yeah. 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 because there is a hope, there is hope, there is hope, there is hope. Mm -hmm. and not about being the hope. You know, if you have hope without works, it's just a whole lot of bullshit. Okay. Because uh, if you look at very well this Nigeria now, for we to achieve uh, this uh, food circulation and food security, I think uh, we should bring down agriculture, not just bringing it down, like to you know to the grassroots. Like if I believe that every state, no matter how small the state is in this Nigeria, we have empty lands, lands that are not occupied. If the government take it as a sole responsibility to create what is called government businesses, you know, uh, there is nothing like government. There are few government businesses. You can only see the oil sector. That's the government businesses. But if the government should like have farms that they manage both the distribution of it they have particular markets they sell these things and people can go and buy when the government is able to produce like this nigeria is boasting about 300 million population and nigeria cannot even produce up to 7 million tons of rice per, per, num, per year so how with this population even if we decide to be importing rice we are just enriching the other countries that we are importing from and we are, we are yeah. in our own country uh -huh. So the price of price can never go down, except if the government, because uh, you know we have privatized. The government has privatized everything in this Nigeria. They can't even do anything. The big sectors. Okay, let's talk about uh, if we are talking about military, for instance. Look at American government and Russian government. Uh, those Russian military, American military. Do you know that those government, those military arms of government, the arms of gov of the country. Do you know that those people they produce something that earns money for the government. So, we, we have a Nigerian military, they, they might have schools they are running, but you cannot be depending on the people. If there is no exportation of your products, then that will be a whole nonsense. So, there must be something you are able to produce that will serve other nations and also serve your country. So, Nigeria is supposed to be able to be producing about 21 million tons of rice per annum. As Nigerian government, not individuals, not uh, all this, it doesn't work. All these uh, empowerments, empowering people, you empower them, the economy is rising, and you see they are struggling with their businesses. So what if the government themselves now get these lands, acquire this land, if all lands belong to the nation, to the government. If they acquire this land and now plant on this land, employ people, employ technology, then these processes can be, do, be able to put every state to be held accountable if they cannot produce a particular quantity of rice per, per month. So they should be held accountable. And this rice is not just uh, like planting it to be selling it to retailers, to retailers or wholesalers. When you when they plant it, they should be able to retail it by themselves so that citizens can go to a particular market. You know that this is a place you can buy the rice, you buy the rice at a cheaper rate. But even all these things, government should even be able to produce meat you see you see fishes you see all these things government should be able to produce them in large quantities because once it is being produced in large quantities they sh they should be accountability there should be specificity some once once it is this particular time once is this particular time this certain if it's this state they are able they should be able to be held accountable they should be held accountable or to be able to produce this quantity of rice quantity of beans quantity of this you know every nigerian land is better i say every nigerian land is better every nigerian soil is better so if these things are put in place i think nigeria if these things are put in place i think the country will I, I I hope the government should hear you out. I hope they should hear this thing you are saying. It's a very simple thing. It's, very simple. it's a very simple thing. All the money they, they invest on things that doesn't work. That doesn't make sense. That, doesn't make sense. that, that are not necessary. So they will tell you that they are empowering people. You see, even after giving you the money, if they do give at all, self, even after giving you the money, you don't know what the money where the money went to. 
you are just trying to be able to balance yourself. Price of things is not as it is today. It's not the price of things today. You go to market every time. Every time, sometimes you go to market, you will see that it has added hundred naira, three hundred naira every day. Every day. Every day. So, so it's just a. Uh, I would say.